Hello, Helene. You weren't expecting to see me here, Helene? Were you waiting on a date or something? No, uh, you know, to be honest, I sort of gave up on that whole dating thing. It's just too much drama. Yeah, me too, me too. Uh, so you're not here expecting to see a Mr. Possibilities? Who? N no. No, I, I, I don't even know who that is. Oh. <laughs> Helene. <laughs> what? Who is he? Well, he's nobody. Yeah, he doesn't exist. I'm sorry, did you think... Yeah, the really bad news for you is that I created him. To prove a point. Lassie, we gotta go! Jules is in trouble! What are you talking about? I'll explain on the way. Gus, come on! Such a beautiful day, isn't it? Let's go look at some ducks. Come on, nice and easy. Nice and easy. It'll be just like a date. To prove a point to who? Oh, to all you women. Because you lie. Watch your step. You say you want the nice guy. You say you want the good guy, but then it's <laughs> you're all so shallow, and I just proved it. Oh, I hate this. This is just... This is just a terrible, horrible thing you're making me do, Helene. Mike, no one is making you do anything. Yes, you are! Mike, Juliet's date from the Italian restaurant. Oh, yeah, I dated both those girls that were killed. Yeah, they rejected me. They gave excuses why they weren't ready for a relationship, and then they turned around, and they were totally interested in my... Uh, <laughs> Fictitious alter ego, Mr. Possibilities, because he's good looking. And he seems flawless. You see, women don't want what they say they want. And you're the same. All right, this was the meeting spot. Can't be far off. Let's split up. Remember our date at the restaurant? Remember what you told me? Do you remember how you told me that things were, uh, what was it? What was it, Helene? They were too complicated? They were too complicated for you? And then you turn around. And you write to Mr. Possibility, you practically beg him, beg to go out with him. I almost gave you a pass, but then you kept writing. You were relentless. You just had to go out with him. Didn't you? No, I didn't. But don't turn around! But I'm not like those other girls. I did like you. Maybe a little too much. I just didn't think that you were into me. I mean, you actually, you made me a little nervous because I just didn't think that someone like you would take someone like me seriously. It's true. I just wondered the whole time what you looked like without those glasses. May I? When I look into your eyes, I see how deeply you feel things. And I understand why you had to do what you did to those girls. What you do? And now, it can just be you and me. Oh, come on, you guys, get a room. Really? See? Fake dating isn't all as cracked up today. Had its moments. You made out with a serial killer. You made out with Lassiter. Okay, I guess that makes us even. Jules, I had a startling revelation this week. I'm ready to cohabitate with someone. Really? Someone? I was gonna put an ad in Craigslist, but I mean, if, I mean, if you know somebody, I'm <laughs> wide open. I, uh, I like the way we fit. And I'm not just talking about when we spoon it up half moon style, although that's tight. I think it's time that we moved in together. <laughs>